Nice, welcome everyone. I hope you are having a wonderful day. And I am glad that you're here. So thank you for stopping by. Um, we, oh shit, here we go. <coughs> we are gonna watch FF7 Rebirth stuff. So let's go. What happened to this place? It was Sephiroth. He wants to finish what he started rule over the planet we have to help them you coming way ahead of you let's get to work oh, shit. i will reclaim our world yo what's up Square Enix series producer final fantasy 7 no final fantasy 7 reverse ga ついに本作のストーリーは主人公クラウドとその仲間たちが宿敵であるセピオスを追いかけ魔法都市ニートガルの外にある広大な世界へと足を踏み出すところから物語が始まります今回のステートプレイではこのゲームの魅力を凝縮した最
It's about saving the world. And you. The reunion. When spite and sorrow are harvested to feed the planet. No! On to this. 皆さんこんにちは「ファイナルファンタジー7リバース」ディレクターの浜口直樹ですトレーラーはいかがでしたでしょうかここからは本作がどのようなゲームなのか私から皆様にご紹介していきたいと思います I'm waiting, Cloud. In Final Fantasy VII Remake, Cloud and his companions triumph over destiny. Leaving the city of Midgar behind, they step out into an unfamiliar wilderness. It is here that Final Fantasy VII Rebirth begins. I just finished re、uh, Remake last week, so all this is hitting real hard. The stage upon which this ragtag band story unfolds is both vast and varied. The world is made up of multiple regions, all seamlessly interconnected. Holy shit! The grasslands. Located due south of Midgar, this is where Cloud and the gang resume their adventure. The Junon region. Where a metropolis by the same name overlooks the ocean, a symbol of Shinra's military might. The Karel region. The resort town of Costa del Sol、yeah. adorns its northern shore, <laughs> while the gold saucer stands as a gilded oasis above the dust bowl far to the south. The Gengaga region. Pay tribute to Zack by exploring his hometown. Or visit what remains of the local Mako reactor. The Cosmo Canyon region. Become one with the planet as you return to Red 13's roots. The Nebel region. Take a trip down memory lane with Cloud and Tifa. Or stop by Shinra Manor, where Vincent rests in peace. Your adventure will even extend to the high seas. Oh my god, this game is so massive. There's more to do than simply walk around, however. First, let's look at World Intel. Assisting Chadley with his research will deepen his understanding of the world, allowing him to develop new materia. This research takes many forms, such as wrangling chocobos or playing with the Mooglets at their mog stools. You may also come across sanctuaries brimming with knowledge of divine entities, or lairs inhabited by fearsome, unique foes. Chadley will also enlist your help in researching mysterious artifacts known as proto relics. Each investigation is its own side story, featuring a colorful cast of characters, exciting new mini games, and ferocious creatures. Are you up for the challenge? And once you recover、oh、all the proto relics scattered throughout the world, there's no telling what new developments might be in store. Next, let's talk about odd jobs. These quests offer a deep dive into the regions of the world and the crazy characters who inhabit them. As a merc, Cloud will accept <laughs> work from people he meets in his travels, and team up with his pals to solve the problems. Oh, nice! What's up, Ryan? Thanks for stopping by. By helping、man. those in need, he will also strengthen the bonds between him and his comrades. <laughs> the frogs. Each one of these. Man, that was so annoying in remake. Holy shit!、Story. Some Every time you get turned into a frog, line, borrow aspects from the original FF7, while others highlight content exclusive to Rebirth. You'll find all sorts of jobs the world over. 
And don't worry if you leave some for later. Story oh progression God. won't affect your side hustle. You can always go back to tie up loose ends. And this freedom to experience the story oh, how that's you great. want okay. is one of Rebirth's greatest strengths. I, th I think Remake had that issue While where some like, if you progress too far, to world you couldn't do certain jobs, things. Many are not. For example, popular ones from the Gold Saucer, such as 3D Brawler, G-Bike, and Chocobo Racing are in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth 2. Others improve upon their remake versions, while still more so. are completely new to Rebirth. There were some points... Well, We've now that I think about it, I was doing everything as I could, as part so of the original um, Final I think I got like, almost everything. Because I was just trying to do everything in the game. Though this one is not in uh, the original, first I through. highly suggest you check out the but, card uh, game. But I'm Queen's pretty Blood. sure that once no you progress where you to a certain story, point, you can't it's sure to both challenge and missions. entertain you. Enjoy collecting all the cards because and building Because later in the game, some areas are cut decks. off because of the, the plate falling. He's planning to use the black materia, but I won't let that happen. He has to be stopped. Dude, this is going to be nuts. By a cetera. I wonder how and the I'm demo's going to be. While mini games and map exploration are a big part of Rebirth's charm, there's more to it than just that. Rebirth provides a cinematic experience with even higher quality content and more of it than Remake. This well, installment remake was, follows Cloud and company after they escape was Midgar, crazy because it was up such through a small, their arrival well, at not the Forgotten small, Capital. But it was like a very compact area. And We've they taken quite a bit with it, so to depict how the group can't bonds imagine how much during their journey, game. one that ultimately decides ere its fate. Once you finish Rebirth, I'm sure you'll agree that no other game makes you feel quite this close to its characters. Not even him. As for the graphics, Rebirth makes full use of the PlayStation 5 and its SSD. Meaning we could use much higher resolution wait assets for than the we PC could version. And they will still load in the blink of an eye. Maintain a 60 FPS frame rate with performance mode. PS5 is it's like or a PS4 Pro plus 4K resolution with graphics mode. Which is it's gonna be which performance. Every Rebirth has you covered. 1080, 60, or 4K, 30. That's what it's going to be. Each character interacts with the world in their own way. I'm not surprised. Barrett shoots objects. It's disappointing. Yuffie swings across gaps. Tifa has her grappling gun. Better than Red can climb along walls. Uh, than remake because Kate Sith grabs and throws items. Remake, uh, and Aerith manipulates the life stream. Remake didn't have very good Whatever graphical settings. Whatever challenges you face, your and teammates so will be ready to help you overcome There was some like, hitching and stuff, but this all looks great. Now for the music. We wanted to pay respect to the original FF7's tracks, but also challenge ourselves by matching the feeling of each yeah, scene. Yeah, so cool. Which resulted in some truly innovative arrangements. I like all their outfits. Like, for example, the following. Like, you can already kind of tell. How is that? Uh, it's about the same, I think, as If you enjoyed what you FF, heard, FF, we recorded well remake. over 400 new tracks for this game. So there's plenty more where that Holy came from. Holy shit, 400? Thank you for choosing Bronco. There's going to be S links. We sincerely hope you enjoyed your trip with us. Your party's bonds aren't just reflected in the story, but through gameplay as well. The choices you make throughout your adventure will change the way your comrades feel towards you. What? Yeah. At least I made that promise to you. These feelings affect who will join you on a date in the Gold Saucer. What? Something I'm sure many of you are excited about. Hell yeah. In fact, even allies who weren't available in the original FF7 can now accompany you. 
provided you play your cards right. <laughs> the saucer hey, is packed uh, with Manatee, many incredible how is my audio, sights to by the see way? and things what, to how's do. How's the mixing? Is it okay? So your outing there will no doubt be a highlight of the game. Already have someone who you'd like to go with? Well, we hope they feel the same way too. Am I am I too loud or too soft or is the not only with cloud but with video each other as well? Too up, up or down? Like I don't know. Your party level, a numerical expression of this bond, will increase as you overcome challenges. I'm going to accompany you. The higher this level, the more skills will become available in your character's folios. Okay. A mechanic I think that should be better. I turned it down a little bit. By unlocking the skills etched in these tones, your characters will grow stronger and learn new synergy commands. Part of what makes Rebirth's combat so fun is all the different character combinations. Nice, thank you. Switch up your team to fit the situation, or even your mood. Every possible party combination has its own unique synergy commands. Oh, that's so cool! So once you find characters that work for you, focus on tweaking their skills to match your combat needs. And don't be afraid to experiment. You can reset your folios at any time. Man, that's what I love so much about the DLC. Because Yuffie and you Sonon had their, like, synergy commands at your yeah, their synergy thing. And they could attack together and stuff. It was really cool. Action combat and strategic planning has been made even more dynamic and engaging. I wonder how... We can't wait for you to experience all this and more in Final Fantasy VII Looks Rebirth like it's going to be the same, like, ATB 5. system. And, like... Kind of half... Turn-based and half, um... Character action. Come on。本日より、ファイナルファンタジー7を先行してプレイしていただける体験版を配信いたします。この体験版では、物語の重要なポイントとなるニブルヘイム事件が収録されており、クラウドやセフィロスを操作することができます。Now the main question is, is the progress going to carry over? Episode one? Are you talking about within um The demo would be. Oh, that was it, huh? That was quick. 